Common Core has been developed with the direct support of the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, which has invested $173 million in the development of Common Core materials and promoting the initiative at the state level, and an estimated $2.3 billion in total funding related to Common Core standards development, including grants for the development of biometric bracelets that will monitor students' interest level in class. And you start out that article with a very specific discussion of a Gates Foundation funded program called the Measures of Effective Teachers Project. project. So perhaps you can tell us about this, this project and its significance. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the uh, Measures of Effective Teachers Project is part of a $45 million plan to quantify, to measure school teachers' alleged efficiency in delivering the public school curriculum. Uh, the project has a great many individuals involved, including academic psychologists, uh, sociologists, education scholars, even a statistician from the RAND Corporation. Uh, the experiment began in uh, 2009 and focuses mainly on inner city schools. Now, the whole idea behind this is the establishment of a metrics for identifying techniques to maintain young people's attention spans. Uh, this looks to be in part a type of audience research, complete with galvanic skin bracelets to measure uh, student behaviors and reactions. So the ostensible use of the data will be to determine how teachers will be hired, uh, compensated, promoted, and so on. Uh, we have to be put on guard when we hear terms such as measurement or quantification, uh, especially when it comes to education and teaching, because these were the techniques originally used to bring uh, psychology into the American educational enterprise uh, to, to begin with. Um, the fact that this is being done to mainly uh, African-American and Latino children in uh, inner city schools should also call to mind how early social science has been used to perpetuate eugenics and, uh, and emphasize the alleged racial, uh, racially specific uh, inferiorities of, uh, of non-whites. Um, so the, um, the project overall um, essentially involves the dehumanization of what is an inherently human process, that is cultivating individuals to recognize and aspire to a higher intellectual level. Uh, the public school curriculum, the abundance of standardized testing, and now programs like these collectively act as a harness on real education. It's an attempt to refine the psychological conditioning and curriculum delivery process for a curriculum that is more or less dead on arrival and intended to discourage independent thought and curiosity. 